hi guys welcome back to my channel so what's going on now is i have a mary Kay virtual party starting in 20 minutes and um you know i have no makeup on whatsoever other than a little mascara that i've had on since 2 30 this morning i was like you know i'm not gonna bother putting makeup on i'm just gonna wash it off anyways yada yada so then I was like, you know what, I'm re representing this company. I want to look professional and look the part when I first get on to the live. And then I always love seeing, um, like when I use my Skin Vigor brush, I love to show them all the makeup that comes off. So I'm going to do my makeup really fast. I'm going to show you how I do a quick, fast makeup routine that only takes like maybe 10 minutes. So I am going to start with foundation primer. Even though... I'm washing it off right away. The primer is great with filling in the pores, filling in any imperfections, dimples, little crevices that you do not want on your face. Okay, and they, I like to let that sit. And they say uh, your brows frame your face, which they completely do. So I'm gonna draw on some brows. <laughs> guys this is all i have left of my brow pencil <laughs> and uh time for a new one luckily i have some in stock just kind of define it a little bit more i just kind of defined it a little bit more next i'm taking my brow tint Running that through again. I'm almost out of this as well But they just add so much to the brows All right now normally I take concealer and kind of uh, clean up the brow edges a little bit but keeping this short like I said so my foundation primers had time to set I'm gonna take foundation Now you guys, you could be thinking, oh um, my gosh, this foundation color is way too light for her. And it is when you first put it on. All of Mary Kay's matte time-wise foundations, if they're matte, they are a little bit lighter in color. But as they go on your face, as you blend it in the foundation oxidizes and it warms up to your skin tone and it actually kind of changes and matches your skin tone perfectly so i'm just putting a real light coverage on because after all if you're using mary Kay skincare you don't need that much foundation because your skin's already perfect all right now, I get up at 2.30 in the morning. I haven't been going to bed at, until like 11 p.m. I know. I need more sleep. So, to get rid of dark under eye circles, I have this magic stuff. Under eye corrector. has a slightly peachy tone to get rid of my dark under eye circles. I have a very narrow face, so I don't technically need to contour if I don't want to. I always love to contour because it gives me kind of that sculpted look still, but I'm short on time, so I'm just going to skip it. Um, so if I was going to contour, I would do bronzer. Oh, well, ooh, ooh, I might do... Translucent powder. Just put some under my eyes gonna take a fluffy butt brush pick up a little bit more Can I come in really quick, quick? sure what even better in person okay three good luck ones oh gosh thank you yes I I know seven is a lucky number but has dad called yet yeah he did okay yeah. I kind of heard something about dad, so I was like, is he on his way or not? And so thank you so much for everything. And yes, I need to attend back to kiddos. And yes. Thank you. Yeah. She didn't even realize I was filming. And she brought me three cookies for 
Good luck on my new cake party tonight. <gasps> uh, okay, I have no idea what happened to my brushes, but I'm going in with some blush just to warm up, or not warm up, give my cheeks some color. And, you know, I think I do want to do some bronzer just to warm up my face. So I have this bronzer here. I'm just going to go in with a fluffy brush. Okay, eyeshadow. Mary Kay came out with this liquid eyeshadow. It is the bomb. Everyone needs it in their life. I'm just gonna put a little bit, just to add some glitter, some sparkle. Just gonna take my ring finger, pat it out. All right. Uh, normally I would take some other shadow and kind of um, darken the crease a little bit, but short on time, making this fast, sweet, easy, peasy. Now, I do want to finish off lips. Now, normally I would line my lips and do all that stuff, but like I said, I'm washing all this off in like 10 minutes. So I'm just going to go in with a coat of my favorite, favorite lip color right now, Luminous Lilac. Look so beautiful. I literally wear it with everything. It lasts so long. There you have it. Fast, easy, put together a little bit more than I was before. Um, if I was planning on wearing this a long time, I would go in with my Mary Kay setting spray. You want to shake it, spray, sets your makeup all day, all day long. So I don't even know what that was. It was 10 minutes. And that was with me frantically digging around for products that I did not have laid off. Oh, there's my mascara. Uh, long story short. Okay. I seem to have a bad habit of losing mascara. I gave my full-sized intensity at Mary Kay mascara to my daughter. I just ran out of mascara in my inventory. I'm waiting for an order to come in. My daughter lost, she misplaced my mascara. She's one and a half. So I just grabbed one of my sample, ultimate sample mascaras. But I can't seem to open. I used it this morning. There we go. Oh yeah, that second coat added a lot. All right, there it is, my, you know, it took me 10 minutes to explain it. So if I could sit down and do it with no talking, just do it, it'd probably take me five minutes. So there's my five minute basic makeup routine. Yes, I left a lot of stuff out like contour and highlighter and all this stuff. But overall, I'd say I look pretty put together. Don't you agree? So thank you for watching this video. Please give it a big thumbs up. Wish me luck as I go in to have a party. I'm so excited. I love doing these parties. If, if you're interested in having your own party, I do them virtually. So leave a comment down below or find me on Instagram, DM me, Maya's Fun Filled Life, and I would love to do a party with you. So anyways, I gotta go. Have a good night. I will see you next time. Bye.